First at noon, a crane crashes into a North Miami Beach condo building, forcing evacuations. Removing the crane is going to be a bit of a challenge. The Coast Guard is on the scene because a barge the crane is attached to is taking on water. CBS 4's Real Crane is there. She joins us live with the details. Real? Well, this morning we were told that this could be a while, and just before noon, crews now just beginning the work to try to remove this huge crane from the building. They brought in another huge crane to do it, and then it'll be the work of trying to refloat the barge that it's attached to. Tense moments as that massive crane sitting dangerously lodged in the side of a condo with the rising tide shifts again early morning, left dangling in the air. I thought it was a plane crash. Startling to neighbors like Antonio Abru, who heard the collision, but in the dark couldn't see exactly what it was. But I saw the big pieces falling out of the roof. Miami-Dade Fire and North Miami Beach Police responded to the call just after 10.30 Sunday night as that crane came crashing down. Eight units were evacuated in the section of the building where it had plunged through the roof, but no one was hurt. Meantime, the Coast Guard called in to contain okay. the damage, leaking oil spilling into the waterway below. The crane connected to a floating barge. The Coast Guard said it started to fill with water, causing it to nearly tip over. We're still investigating what actually caused the barge to take on water, but right now priority is containing the actual diesel that did discharge from the crane. Boom was placed, five barrels of oily waste and debris collected. Our effort now is to release the building from the stress it has and uh, make everything make that everything is safe. An outside contractor was brought in to begin the hours long process of trying to figure out how to remove it. We are planning to remove the boom of the crane, which is the part that is right now laying off the building. And we are mo we're concerned about that. And obviously we're going to bring another equipment to help us get the, bar, the, the crane out. So the work continues uh, at this hour, but very, very slowly right now. Meantime, many neighbors pointed out that work is still being done on a seawall here along this area, right next to where that barge is at. Many of them suspect that that's what caused the barge to fill with water and tip over. But according to the Coast Guard, there was no active construction happening at the time that that crane came crashing down. We're live in North Miami Beach, Riel Creighton, CBS 4 News.